Maybe there's something in here. Knuckles. Brass knuckles they've actually made useful that, that some of the most of the new uh, blueprints that they put in are brass knuckle blueprints. So that's good that they finally made, you know, brass knuckles useful. Because even on, like, Sambi and Logan who get extra damage with blunt weapons, I still wouldn't pick them up because they do crappy damage. And they have really low durability com in comparison to other weapons. I still don't want to pick them up. <laughs> No, you didn't. Oh my god, are you serious? Nope, no, 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 no. You are not serious with that knife, dude. Good god. I almost died. Thank you for being slow and not messing with me before. I need to repair this. Empty! Oh, 123. I don't know why I thought that said empty. I don't- <laughs> I'm confused. I don't know where I'm going. I mean, I do, but like I'm getting distracted by things like snack that I don't need. why sometimes I sniff. I mean, I, my nose isn't running or anything. Sometimes I just sniff. Um, let's try this. I don't know if it's going to work near that water. Oh, you's on fire. Oh god. There's a ram. Hi, Mr. Ram. Come get this zombie for me. I'm still weasel laughing, aren't I? Oh, damn! Get out of my face! Get out of my face! Oh my god, I'm stuck in a corner. I'm stuck in a corner. Oh, don't you hit me. Don't you hit me. Oh my god. You have like two health. Why are you, why are you in my face? So, those snacks I didn't need before, need them now. <laughs> Where is there's some? I'm not gonna go all the way back to the end of the street to get them. No? Let's open this up. Stinky zombie! Burn. You dead yet? You dead. Oh, a box. I forgot this was here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, why? Why, game, why? Is that what I've got equipped? No, shock machete. Um, except for force. It's better. Why would the axe have less force than a machete? And it handles less. Whatever. It can just stay there, I guess. <sighs> oh my god, are you serious? Are. You. Serious. Making me drop my good weapons. <sighs> okay. Create toxic mod. And oh, I can do it on the military knife, but I don't really need to do that. Oh, I could do it on the cleaver? Could have done it this entire time.
Yes. Create all our Molotovs. Um, but not all of them. Create high voltage on that. That didn't take all that much money at all. I don't want to do the guns yet. Why can I not pick up the Molotov? Did one fall in here? I thought one I kicked one back. Guess not. Oh, can I pick up that thing I just dropped? That would be great if I could pick that up. Of course not. Uh, of course not. But I have better things, so not too sad. Oh good, and my fury's up. For that group way over there. Oh, come on now. Nope. Sit back down. And say goodbye to your head. Wristwatch? Oh, hi, infected. Come on. Come say hi. I have something nice and sharp for you to wear around your neck. Okay, those aren't interested yet. Heavy pistol. Not better than what I have. Don't know why I took that snack. Are you serious? Let me just die right quick. Okay. Oh. Can I loot this person? Oh, I hear an infected. Where? Maybe not. Behind me, behind me, behind me! What, 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 what? Oh my god. <laughs> it scared the crap out of me. Why? Is it is the game doing that? Why? It's my needs to fix that. Like right now. Alright, we still have fire hydrants. I totally forgot. Um Oh, I totally dodged that knife that he threw at me. Oh, hi, zombie. You're on fire. <laughs> this is what a toxic mod does. Oh, and he had a blue. <gasps> That's awesome. That's awesome. I want that. Oh, I want that. Never drop your med kits, but I'm right here and I want that. So, we're going to I don't know why I want that. Oh, why are you not dead? Oh, you oh, I was going to th <laughs> I thought she's going to throw that at me. So, yeah, when you crit with a toxic weapon like I have right now, uh, it makes them puke. So, it's pretty much my favorite way to deal with thugs and rams and special zombies. Is to try to get it to crit and then they puke and they can't do anything. And you just kill them while they're puking. Oh. Really? Hello? Okay, you stay over there then. Alright. Maybe if I go to the church and come back. <laughs> uh... 
those med kits will still be there. If not, they only cost $200, and I have thousands and thousands of dollars. Even though I do kind of need to be staying, staying up, saving up for developer mods. Can't hurt to look. Look at all the exclamation marks for quests we can turn in. Dude, the bells are gone. What are you doing? I killed your family. You're welcome. May God have mercy on their souls. So he gives us a pretty good pistol. Uh, it does more damage, but it does le it's less accurate and the rate of fire. That's why it's a heavy. Oh, but look how much damage it does. Great. Need to sell things. Um. Sell that. Uh, do I want to use those or? I probably don't want to use those. I don't know if I want to use the knife or not. Let me sell this stick. I'm not going to use this stick. Probably not going to use this pistol either. I can buy it back. If necessary. But. Spiteful heavy pistol. Pretty Did good. Those posters up? No, I didn't. I'm not doing your quest until later. Like, in a second later, but later. I need to put something on this cleaver, but I don't know what. Alright, let's go talk to Mother Helen. God bless you. Water will help us survive these dark days and better serve our Lord and Savior. You're welcome. Your good deeds have reignited hope in the hearts of those who survived to serve the Lord. Any water could do so when much. When the end of days began, the people were afraid. Many panicked and rioted. Stores were looted. There's nothing left here. You will have to search in the wealthy part of town. Unfortunately, there's no good way to get there. The wealthy didn't want the poor taking what was theirs. Rich. So they bastard. destroyed all the bridges, cutting themselves off from the rest of the city. I don't know whether you wish to save the world or bring it down. But until time ends, we can still save the innocent. One of our flock, Joseph, knows the way. He will help you. Level up. Awesome. Oh. Sedamoy. <gasps> So, for those of you who don't know, Bobby is actually Jack the Doctor, uh, the guy who wanted to kill you in the beginning. So apparently he's just bent on killing everyone that might have a chance to be a zombie. Um, I guess his name was going to be Bobby originally, and then they changed it to Jack, but then they didn't, they didn't change um, some of the lines and stuff. Let me level up right quick. Uh, I got that, so... Oh, that'd be nice. Let's get this. Okay, uh, for some reason, uh, I recorded myself doing or getting some quests, and for some reason, I don't have that video anymore. It's completely lost. I have no idea where it is. So, um, I'm just gonna update you after. We talked to Bruno. We need to bolster the church against any attacks from those undead demons. For that, we need some special tools. Will you help us find them? 
So we have to go all the way back to the pump station to get these tools. <laughs> oh, excellent. The, the tools I have in mind are in Antonio's workshop at the pump station. It's one of one of many quests that ask you to go back to somewhere that you just cleared of being dangerous when they could have just given you that quest before. Um, I'm not sure what you've what quest you've seen and what you haven't seen. Uh, to update you, we still have to get insulin for um, this girl back here. Uh, we still have to hang up his posters. Um, we took care of Mugambe's family. Uh, this guy wants batteries, but we are totally not ever going to get him batteries because batteries are used for um, electric mods. So I'm going to be selfish and not give them to him. Uh, Hugo wants us to go like out you know, somewhere down south in the city and give somebody a message so he can put it on the radio. Uh, and then he said he was going to call that person on the radio to tell him that we were coming. So I asked why he couldn't just radio him what they wanted to say. But whatever. <laughs> whatever. Um, upstairs, uh, this guy right here, Raymond, uh, he is uh, who you give the will to from the guy that we uh, saw next to the police station. Uh, I can't remember when I turned it in, so... <laughs> Alright. That is uh, what we've got going on. Uh, you're going to be hearing Joseph say that a lot, because uh, I'm. we're not going to do his quest for a while. We're going to finish the rest of the side quest before we do any of that. And for some reason, I keep hitting shift to sprint. <laughs> I get my keybinds mixed up from all the different games. Hi, zombie. Oh. Ow. No. Oh, okay. Ow. Crap. Good start so far. Holy crap, that took a lot of hits. Okay. Actually, I forgot to buy med kits, so I will be right back. Okay, so we're back and we're on the other side of the truck that I was just at. Um, I forgot that there's mini loot here? back here. Uh, what we're going to do now is go hang up Hugo's first poster. Uh... He asked you to hang him up all around the city, so it kind of goes in a big old circle. Crap. Oh, really? Really, zombie? Uh, so you kind of have to do Hugo's... No, wait. His, his name's not Hugo. Hugo's the guy that gave us the quest for the radio. Whatever. <laughs> um... No, there's an infected somewhere. I hear it. Here he comes. Okay. Let's see if I can finish the sentence this time. Oh, I didn't mean to take that. Um, you have to do the post request in stages since, um... You have to go all over the city, and it's just... Oh my god, really? Why is my cleaver not, like, cutting off heads for some reason? Let's sit down. You are not dead. That zombie is never dead. Okay, well, maybe like one time out of ten it's dead, but most of the time, not dead. <laughs> 